Shut up and sit down. Hey you skellywags, today we're looking at this set, a big box of stuff, the Angels Born in Hell set, finally has arrived. Let's uh, get it open. There we go, can have a look at the uh, artwork, a bit clearer now, look at it, in its awesomeness. I think the first, uh, there we go, look, baby on board. First babies of Acid Rain World. The Neo Atlantis. Another one of their crew coming out in January. Female figure, looking very good. Here's the back. With all the stuff you'll get inside. Right. It's open. Yeah. Right, so here we've got instructions. Oh, never seen instructions for the, the drone before. So that's how you transform it. Although I learned that by myself with my own drone. And here, some stuff I'll probably understand more when I open up the bike. Right, there's the, how you'll get it in this box. There's a cellar tape take off. Let's get this thing open. Yeah, little packages things. Babies, Quinn and Finn. Or Arnie and Danny DeVito. This thing. Gun. This thing. The drone babysitter thing. This huge guitar, cello, electric guitar thing. Here we've got the uh, bike. And Caleb. Or as I like to say, or call him, Mads Mickelson of Hannibal fame. And Fantastic Beasts. Well, when it comes out, replacing Johnny Depp. So here's 
everything all laid out kept a few things on him because we're going to replace what he's wearing but let's give him a go first start with Mads Mikkelsen himself brilliant actor uh, extraordinaire very very good sculpt and paintwork on this probably the best in acid rain I've seen very good likeness of Mads Mikkelsen I must say and I do like what he's wearing too look Neo Atlantis there on his body warmer look at the tats these numbers there you can actually read one's there here as well not sure about the arm joints though from black but be like some sort of android or something maybe or have mechanical robot parts yeah these are new i think these trainers i've not seen those trainers before look yeah weathering looking all good you can see a bit of the uh, weathering there right so I'm gonna take this arm off so we can take the body warmer off we'll frame up for some articulation yeah there you go I right, just pop this back on there right so heads you can move around like that got a neck joint there too of course like can go down there up like that um this goes about there there's a movement there roll and that goes all the way around let's uh, get this twist there And that bends about there. Mm, slight bend there, but yeah, it's not supposed to do that really. Twist there, and then left and right. This twist, but goes down and up. Movement up here, and then a twist here. Is Jean Claude or is Mad Balls? Leg goes up like that back not so much this ratchet joint a bit smoother than normal goes all the way up here there is a little bit of a twist there goes down that much up there and then the usual pivot there all right this baby uh, vest thing that's a bit bent this will hold one of your babies. And that will clip in there. Right, off with your head. Uh, robbery. Take this off too. Put this on. So you've got to line it so it goes into that hole too because it does stick out a little bit. Make sure it goes in there. I've got this tool. This just helps it go in more securely. Instead of using your fingers fidgeting about. There we go. Look. All locked in place, nice and secure there. Just pop that back in. Yeah. All right, let's get his uh, mask over his uh, face a bit. There. So he's about to rob somewhere. Ready for babysitting and robbing somewhere. 
So here is uh, Finn and Quinn. So Quinn and Finn, Finn and Quinn, the twins. Baby bottle, look, there you go, drink that little fella. Really detailed or tiny. Just goes in his hand. And you can uh, pop it in there. I can take his face off. So he can put a gas mask. We'll be safe in this uh, acid rain error. You can slip him in there on the back. Not really ideal for uh, babysitting. Should be more secure than that, really. Here, soft goods. A little blanky for this one. So she can go in the drone. Here is the babysitter drone that we've seen before, except it holds a baby inside. Just, yeah, uh, goes in there. Spit it. Uh, comes out. Love transforming these things. Very simple. There you go. Looking badass. Gone. Pops in hand. I've seen this gun before. This huge guitar. I'm liking this. That only comes with this set, as far as I know. I like it. Three-string guitar is massive. Here's the bike. So first time we've seen a spike with this little cart on the side. Same as the capybara and the uh, one for the Corsac Trooper. There's that's okay. That's going to cause some problems if you want to take it apart. A bit more work. Than it should be really, but it does look like the same bike underneath. Right, let's just get this Corsac Trooper, see if he can just sit on really quickly. Yeah, I'll do. Right, so that goes down and this will push forwards all the way. That way you can house this uh, drone. And it can either stand, you align those. Or sideways. Clip it. Let's push it in a bit there. And it's nice and secure. And uh, put baby right weight up. Don't want her to get all dizzy and bump her head and stuff. Put it in there. Let's get the guitar here, let's get everything on this thing. And this extra body warmer. Let's get him on as well. Just pop the sounds in. This one again. There. So yeah, you can uh, fit on there. His left leg's maybe a bit squished, but everything is on this bike from in the box. Awesome. That is what I like to see. Right. So let's just compare with a few of. The acid rain bikes I've got already. Here's the latest. Here's the Corsac one I got recently too. It's the same on the inside as it is with this one and uh, the Capybara here. 
Uh, this one, the capybara, came unassembled, so you had to actually put everything on it. Let's try this gun. Yeah. Yeah, that just slips on, although mine's a bit loose there. So, you can do, but yeah, you just have to align it somewhere properly. But yeah, all accessories work just the same on each of the bikes. One back. Yeah. Right, so yeah, looking at the bottom of this, and compare, I've never really looked at the bottom of this capybara before, but yeah, I don't know if you can take that bit off. You need to do a little bit of work to actually remove that extra car on the side of the bike if you wanted. But I'm sure it can be done. But you'll have to get screwdriver and stuff and disassemble it. See, that's the same. There, uh, yeah, and the inside is uh, a bike inside. Just like that. Alright, yeah. So there's another drone. See if this, yeah, should just be the same. Really, just align them. So any drones you've got that are um, in this line from Acid Rain World should just be able to use on this bike as well. And do it sideways too. I do like these drone things, they're really good. Let's get someone. Oh, yeah, this thing I've tried to. Uh, you're supposed to be able to pull it out for drone, but not been able to. I think when they weather these figures, it does stick a bit, and so it makes it a bit difficult to take out some of the things or use some of these things more easily. There you go. So the seat is ready. Here we'll get Asamite. Nice and cozy in there. Yeah. It's not uh, you know ideal place for someone to sit in but works. Does the job. I can be wielding a weapon at the same time. Going out on any missions. Yeah, it definitely doesn't look like the comfiest in there for uh, someone to sit in. But it'll do. I do love the colours on this thing. Right, so here's my Aegis Sentinel. I'll just change the head and helmet. Um, just because he's the same buck as Caleb here. Let's get him out. There you go. So yeah. Just obviously a few differences in details. Things like that, but... And the colours. The shoes are different, look. Slightly different design. Which is uh, yeah, good they're actually using different feet on some of these figs as well. Alright, let's do a bit of posing just with his guitar.
So this set is not going to be for everyone, um, particularly when most people are looking for war stuff and shooty things. Um, this is more an homage, I think, to Ito Agami, the baby cart assassin, lone wolf and cub, which I thoroughly, thoroughly appreciate. Uh, it adds more depth into your the universe you want to build and something very different. And if you're looking for that sort of war type stuff, this is definitely not for you. If you want a bit of depth and character in your universe, check this out. It might be something you'd be really into. Um, I really enjoy it. And uh, those that are in the know will too. Anyway, I'll scale you later. <laughs> Go to sleep, a little child, uh, my son and daughter. And uh, you will uh, dream in your sleep. And, uh, you... Hey, you skellywags! Oh, skelly, you're right on time. Um, for what, say? Yes, um, uh, you can here take care of uh, the children, the twins. Oh. Quinn and Finn. Okay, I see. Right, um, hello, Quinn and Finn. Here you go, Quinn oh, and oh. Finn. Uh, you're a lifesaver. I just have to, uh, pop off down the road for a bite. Hmm. This is not how I thought this day would end up. Uh, coochie coo! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, coochie coo coo! You can save me from this hell if you like, comment, and subscribe. Ooh, check the Patreon too.